So let's take a look and see which one of these two fractions is larger, 3 eighths or 5 ninths. And here's how we can do it. You could just on a calculator take 3 and divide it by 8, get a decimal, divide 5 by 9, get a decimal and compare them. And that would tell you which is larger, 3 eighths or 5 ninths. The other way to do it, we could find a common denominator. Right now we have 8 and 9. But if we had this in common, our denominator, we just compare the numerators. We figure out which is greater. So let's just take 8 and then we'll multiply it by 9. So when we do that, we end up with 72. So there's our denominator here. Down here, I'm going to multiply 9 times 8, and that equals 72 as well. So now, denominators are the same, but I can't just multiply the denominator here by 8. I also have to multiply the numerator by 8. That's because 8 over 8, that's just 1. So I'm just multiplying by 1. I don't change the value, just the way it's represented. 5 times 8 is 40. Up here, I need to multiply by 9. So 3 times 9, that's 27. Since we have the same denominator, we just compare the numerators. So 40 is greater than 27. So 40, 70 seconds, that's going to be greater than 27, 70 seconds. And since these are equivalent here, and these are equivalent here, 5 ninths. That's going to be greater than 3 eighths. That's how you do it. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.